Tara Tom here. I'm so appreciative that you're with me today. We're going to talk about Amazon Redshift. The most important subject with massively parallel processing systems and the most difficult and misunderstood concept is how joins are done on these systems. You're going to see a short film next, a parody. It's going to be funny, it's going to be silly, but it's got a very important point to exactly how big data computers do joins. You wake up in the morning and you've never felt better. Put on your new suit. Your hair is perfect. You gotta skip to your step and you can't wait to get to work. And when you go to the elevator, you find yourself riding up with the CEO. You both banter back and forth and you're asked about your work philosophy. Ask not what your company can do for you. Ask what you can do for your company. The CEO says, you're the type of person we need in the executive office. I am going to double your salary. Have a resume on my desk in 15 minutes. When you leave the elevator, panic sets in because you don't have that resume. So you call your spouse and you say, I don't have time to explain, but I have to get a resume in 15 minutes. Listen, honey. I will do the first part of my resume, my goals, where I've worked, what I've accomplished. You work on the second half of the resume, where I went to school, favorite hobbies, make stuff up if you must. And hurry, because we only have 12 minutes left to complete this. After 11 minutes, you call your spouse and you have one more problem. You have to paste both parts of the resume together. You either have to send your spouse your copy or have your spouse send you theirs. You tell your spouse to send it to you and you then paste the two halves together and print your resume. Now you're on your way to the executive office for the career opportunity of a lifetime. What up? In our parody, we just saw two half resumes come together and be joined. They had to be on the same PC because they both had to be in the same memory where they could be joined and saved to disk. Now, let me say it very clearly. For two rows to be joined together from two separate tables, those rows physically have to be on the same slice. Now, they probably won't be there to start, but the system will move one or both of those rows to the exact same slice where they can go in the exact same memory and they can be joined together. Take a look at this first picture here. Both tables have the same distribution key and they will be joined by that distribution key. So naturally the matching rows are already on the same slice. That is a concept so that when the joins are done, neither one of those tables have to be moved. And that is why you do that. In this next picture, and this is equally as important and clever, you're going to have one of the tables with a distribution key. So the data is spread out that way on that key. But the other table it's joining to, the department table, is an all distribution. So all the rows are on slice one, all the rows are on slice two, slice three, slice a thousand. So whenever you join these two tables together, no rows need to move, no columns need to move because even though it's a way of kind of cheating by having the all on every single slice, the matching rows being joined are already on the same slice. And that's the biggest reason that you do an all, so that when you're going to join this, no data has to move. Because remember the concept, 
all rows being joined have to be on the same slice. Now here is a third concept, very clever. You have a fact dimensional type of model. Huge fact table with millions, billions of rows. And it's going to join to many smaller dimension tables that may be wide column tables, but there's not that many rows. You also will usually have one of your dimension tables that's the largest one. So in this case, you take your fact table. What are you joining it on? Oh, we'll make that the distribution key and we'll make the largest dimension table a distribution key by the same join criteria and then we'll make all the other dimension tables alls. And that way, whenever any combination of these tables are going to be joined, there's going to be no data movement within the system to get the matching rows on the same slice.